Mark, what a performance from the boys tonight. I mean, the first half they controlled the game. Second half they didn't really come out and show what they were capable of, but they managed to grind out a, a 1-0 East Belfast Derby win, which is a great result for the boys, especially with, with the R on the table tonight. Matthew, absolutely brilliant, and simply for the fact that, that what you said, would they grind it out? You know, mm-hmm. I think um, their goalkeeper made the most saves, and, and we were definitely the better side, but I think what got us there was we've played them f- four times or yeah. five times, and we've been a better team yep. and we just couldn't get over the line and tonight we didn't play good football that we normally do but tonight was the night we got over the line and it was an ugly way to get over the line yeah. you know they're a battling side they're a good side you know but it shows the quality that we have here we've played all our rivals this month we asked them for a target and they've been brilliant yeah, I mean obviously came in tonight's game a bit of uh, momentum going in after last week's win but I mean tonight to go 1-0 up earlier on and again I mean, Second half, would you agree, wasn't as as bright and as, as sharp as the first half? No, second half wasn't, and as I say, but what it was, it was one of them ones you just have to dig in. Mm-hmm. You know, you, um, you have to get the result. You could go there and we could have played great football tonight and probably conceded or something yeah. like that. You know, I think we should have had our penalty before that one. Yeah. You know, their keeper in the second half made a couple of great saves for yeah. Palladium, you know. He made a couple, of, but I think all in all, you know, it wasn't the prettiest game, but we deserved their win. I mean, you, you knew you were coming here tonight. You knew they were going to battle. Obviously, we talked about it before the game. You know, you knew they were going to come here. You thought maybe a couple more first teamers would have been in the game tonight. But I mean, to grind that type of performance out against that type of team, obviously up, up our backsides, basically at, on the league table. I mean, you couldn't ask for any more. I'm sure the boys are exhausted. I'm seeing a few of them going off with a couple of knocks as well. But I'm sure they're uh, they're bouncing in there. Yeah, no, they, they are. And obviously, we lost Bradley before the game, and we lost Mason during the game, and. Mm. Um, the likes of we Jamie we thought we had him back and and unfortunately we didn't have him back this week but you know no the, the boys were super as I say 10 points this month out of 12 and oh, we've played our rivals so I'm absolutely delighted yeah we've got another one coming up on Saturday at home as well again every game's you know a different game and a, another tough game the only good thing is it's a home game this week you know and we boys love playing at home you know we love that pitch mm. we love playing football and of course, you're going in on the back of a derby win, so you should be buzzing. You know, there's nothing like beating your rivals, you know, so you should be absolutely buzzing. Well, the thing is, Mark, I mean, we're sitting currently in a position where we've got games in hand. We're obviously set, sitting second. I mean, it's a great position to be in at the moment. It's, it's absolutely magnificent, considering we've got, you know, you've got the manager there who's taking players and giving them chances, and, and so you're, you're getting players up. But then to sit in the position we are shows that the quality that we have in the squad, you know, the, the, the squad is magnificent. And some guys didn't get on tonight and, and they're really good players. Yeah. But there'll be days they get on and others won't. You know, it's just football. It's, as I say, it's the nature of the game, but they're a big squad and they're all part of it. So It's a nice headache to have as well. Obviously, we're having so many boys in the squad that are fit and healthy and ready to go. I'm sure it's a headache for you, but it's a good headache to have. It's a nightmare. <laughs> some, some nights you, you're, you're going through teams in your head four yeah. or five times and you're you're thinking of this one's played a lot of minutes and yeah. is it time for a rest and then but it's an or big game and you're thinking oh maybe I should just leave it at the minute the way it's mm. going so yeah it is a headache but it's, it's obviously a, a really good headache well big smiles obviously from tonight's win obviously enjoy the rest of the win go way back into the boys there and hopefully yeah. they'll, they'll enjoy it tonight can't wait absolutely <laughs> delighted and go in there and everybody's buzzing and yeah. that's what can you ask for